If you're watching this video, I'm betting your notion journey has probably gone something like this. Wow. This looks like a really awesome way to organize all my digital stuff. Hmm. Actually, this is a lot harder than I was expecting. Why do I need a database for this? Wait, what? Huh? Whoa. Yeah, this doesn't feel productive at all. If this looks familiar, don't worry, you are in good hands because I found a far better Notion alternative, which makes it way easier to get started at keeping productive. <music> If you've ever thought about setting up your own productivity system, you've probably come across Notion. It's got a lot going for it and it's incredibly popular. In fact, Notion has around 100,000 signups a day, but over 80% of those report struggling in their first session. You see, the thing is, if you like to think in a visual way, Notion's pages of databases and tables are probably going to send you mad especially if you're just getting started. Now, around two years ago, I tested out a fledgling productivity app called Xtiles that showed bags of promise. And even though it was new to the scene, it was unlike anything else I'd tried. But like any new app, it was missing a bunch of crucial features. So I drifted back to some other options. In this video, which is being sponsored by Xtiles, I'm returning to check this app out now that it's all grown up to see how it stacks up next to Notion. And to prove my point that this is a genuine Notion beta, I'm going to show you how easy it is to use by building a full content system from scratch in about 60 seconds. Let's go. Okay, so signing up for an account is pretty straightforward. And once you're in, you've got a few options. Firstly, look at all these templates. Now, if you know what you want to make, there's absolutely loads here from ready built monthly planners, business plans, CRM systems, or even full-blown second brain systems. You can add any of these to your workspace or even download them pre-filled so you've got an idea of what you might add to them. There's also a whole marketplace where you can buy and sell templates made by other users, or you can start from an empty setup and build from there it's your choice. In terms of how Xtiles is organized, the hierarchy is pretty simple. It's actually a bit like how you'd organize a notebook or a journal if you're coming from that kind of mindset. There are workspaces, projects, pages, and tiles. Let's start from the bottom up and look at how those work. Now here's a blank page in Xtiles. If I click new, this adds a tile. Tiles can contain pretty much anything from simple text to images, videos, audio, code, lists, or even nested notes. You can arrange them however you want on a page, but they will try to help you out by snapping onto this grid. You can also color code them and even link them together. So if I grab a link here, I can then link it over on this tile. This is really great if you're writing a book or if you're researching an article, you can have references popping up everywhere. And this is a really good way to make sure everything's in the right place. You can also tag tiles by adding them to these collections, which then makes them easier to keep together. So that's all about tiles. Tiles sit on pages, and although a page is pretty much infinite, you can add multiple tabs to your pages to help organize your stuff, and then also easily move your tiles between these tabs. For example, if you have a page for recipes, you could add collections for different types of cuisine, or for the amount of time that they might take to cook. All of your pages live in projects, and then your projects live in workspaces. You might, for example, have a personal workspace for all your life admin, and then maybe a different one for work. They've made it super easy to share stuff too, so you can share a whole workspace, let's say a company wiki for your team, or you can just share individual projects, or if you like, even just the odd page. Now, one thing Notion has tried really hard to integrate over the years is to be a proper task management system. It hasn't done it yet because guess what? It's made it super complicated. Well, Notion tasks are just a massive database and building a method to just quickly add them is astonishingly hard. Xtiles, on the other hand, just made it really simple. You can add tasks in any workspace or a page, and then in the app, it gets its own little space where you can see any tasks that are due and they're assigned to you. All you do is you add a task and it'll show up here automatically. If you're on a paid plan, you can have them recurring and also connected to projects or pages. That same simplicity goes for calendar and also simple notes. All of that is here and it syncs beautifully between desktop and mobile apps. 
Now, one way that I found this massively helpful and again, far simpler than Notion is for content planning for this channel. And making YouTube videos is one process all by itself, but I also have an email newsletter that goes out once a month. I've got a regular posting for community of members over on my website. Plus, I've got all sorts of other social feeds that need looking after. If anyone else does any of this, you'll know how easy it is to lose track of this stuff if there isn't a single place where you can go to to know what should be happening and when. I borrowed this calendar template, which I've tweaked a bit, but it's nice to have a bird's eye view of what I need to get done and when, plus be able to plan out each post and have a monthly view of what goals I'm trying to achieve. Now, I tried making this dozens of times in Notion, but it just never worked for me. It turns out, I needed something that was built for visual thinkers. Price-wise, Xtiles is free to get started. This gives you lots to play with, including unlimited projects and blocks, tons of free templates, and the ability to invite guests, unlimited storage, and five pages per project, which for a free offer is a lot. If you upgrade to their starter or plus packages, you'll be looking at about $49 or $99 per year respectively, and you'll get pretty much unlimited everything, plus cool stuff like Google Calendar integration, access to premium templates, sign up forms, and also a space for your team to collaborate. I'm also told that there's an AI assistant coming soon. Obviously this by itself is cheaper than Notion's annual plus or business plans, but bearing in mind, you're also incorporating things like task management, documents and storage costs, plus any project planning systems. I think this is really well priced and there are discounts available for educators, students and nonprofits. I've added a sign up link here and also in the description if you wanna go and have a play. And meanwhile, I'm interested to know if you could organize anything in your life right now, what would it be? Let me know down in the comments and I'll come back to tell you if there's an XTAR template that could probably help. I'll see you next time.